One of the first things that every student skydiver learns is to constantly check their, al their altimeter. How high am I? Well, the company that makes a lot of those altimeters that we've come to know and love is L&B, and we're here with Mads from L&B. So, uh, welcome to the show. Thank you very much. So, uh, what products have you brought to the show that are new that everyone out there should be knowing about? It's uh, basically this year, it's the uh, visual altimeters, this uh, Altitrack and the Viso that gives uh, the jumper the best information about uh, the altitude. Uh, we used to make uh, audibles, which we also uh, produce many of, but uh, this year we're excited about to introduce uh, these uh, analog and digital altimeters. So you got some new analog? Yes, uh, and well. uh, analog altimeter, especially for military purpose also. So I, I saw one of them, it looked like it's a pretty tough little altimeter. Yes. Like you could stomp on it, I think. Yes, it's uh, shockproof and uh, water resistant and uh, rocketized what? in the aluminum case. This is uh, the military version of the Altitrack, which features a negative offset and the millibar setting that uh, matches the millibar setting at the uh, military Cypress. So they uh, correspond them together when you uh, need to set it for a, a DC landing point that is different from the airport of takeoff. Looks like a new military mount system of some kind. Yeah, this is uh, the wrist mount version that goes uh, on the on basically on the on on, on the wrist. Can civilians get access to this mounting system? Sure, it's a uh, part of uh, the accessories that uh, are available together with the civilian version. So you've put it in an aluminum housing instead of the plastic housing that you have? Yes, that's for military purpose. <laughs> and are regular skydivers going to have an opportunity to get their hands on one of those? Yes, uh, we have a civilian version uh, that's already selling pretty good. And uh, it's uh, one of... Uh, uh, the attractive uh, instruments that uh, we have uh, shown here at this uh, symposium. This is uh, an accessory for the viso that we are introducing. It's a glove that holds the viso, so it's easy for the jumper to uh, actually keep it uh, fixed on the hand without any unnecessary accessories. <laughs> How soon, how long will it be till this uh, glove is shipping? This will be available in uh, three to four weeks. So good for swoopers and... Good for everybody. And cost on the glove? What will the glove sell for? Uh, about uh, 30 US dollars retail. Well, it's got the cool l and logo on there. <laughs> yeah. Colors so going to be available or just white? Uh, White for now, but uh, we will uh, probably have two or three more colors uh, that are, will be available. Wonderful. Let's get a, caught a shot of the flip side there. That's oh, leather, yeah? Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's uh, leather. So leather on the back, back side for a grip, good so solid grip. Good solid and grip and uh, <laughs> white for, good for when you have air-to-air -air video. One of the things a lot of people talk about is the, the fabulous customer service that L&B offers. Uh, what is it? What's the magic? Why, why are you so hot on that list? We try to keep uh, on top of everything uh, working hard and uh, satisfy the customer best possible. Wonderful. Well, is there anything you want folks out there in the TV land to know that can't be here at the show about what L&B has going on? Well, uh, we have a whole new series of products that uh, we would have liked everybody to come and see. Mads, thank you very much for taking the time and, and speaking with us. It's been a, a very big pleasure. I jumped one of your products and I've learned a lot by interfacing my AltaTrack and my, my JumpTrack software. So okay. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Thank you. Back to you.